I'm just documenting this to show you that we're missing a piece off of here, off of the tailor. So what I'm going to do, actually, I bought um, a bunch of uh, springs from from Home Depot, and I managed to find this one a set of springs in there. It's like that big. So what I'm going to actually do is construct a piece out of a, <clears throat> a black Pepsi Max bottle. <clears throat> and I'm going to adhere, adhere the spring to this somehow. I think I'm going to glue it or something like that or perhaps solder it. I'll have to see what, what works. So when the spring is on here, and it's cut to the right size to cap this, <clears throat> it'll, uh, <clears throat> the, the battery will, will slide in and have some play in there. Uh, like I'll show you. I'll use my fingertip. I'll put the spring on here and just put my finger on there. Put the spring in there, I'm sorry. I'm going to put the spring inside this piece right here. And then put my finger to stop the spring from coming out. So when the batteries are loaded into there, now they have a little bit of play. So the cap, the tailor cap can fit nicely on there. As you see. So you put the cap on. slot. Come on, slot. There you go. Find the slot on there and then turn it. The batteries will be in there just like new. <clears throat> and then you take that off and then the batteries come out. But the spring will stay in there because I'm going to uh, fi fix that somehow for the batteries. <clears throat> and also on here I disconnected this to make sure, I disconnected the red wire, the red is the positive, so the red wire was on here, but I unsoldered it off of there, and this one, this wire, will go in this little slot right here, if you can see, in this little slot, and I'm going to solder that onto the spring, so to make the negative, um, connection and this one will have the positive because the cap around here <clears throat> the cap is all uh, metal on this piece if you could see here you see the metal whoop, you see the metal pieces somewhere I can find it yeah right there so that's where that red wire makes contact. And then this metal piece <coughs> connects to the, this metal piece on the positive side of the battery. So the spring has a negative uh, conductor on there. And this will have the positive, because you put the batteries in that way. And... What am I missing on here? Yeah, so I used a multimeter also, and I saw this around some other eBay videos, that if you place a drop of solder, I had to scrape it off actually, use a multimeter. <clears throat> I scraped, this was very corroded, so I scraped a piece and hit the multimeter on there and then scrape the piece on the bottom because that would corrode it also. That rivet down here. If you can see that rivet, it's all black. I'm trying to do, the camera is on my PC so it's pretty hard to, uh, everything is opposite. So you see that black rivet right there? That's also corroded. So what they do is they put a jumper, a piece of solder, a jumper, and I scraped off a piece 
on where that where this uh, long connection, this wire, this long uh, connection comes down. So I'm going to jump it with a, with a uh, piece of solder, so it'll make the connection there. So then, hopefully, the pickup system will work again. It should work. It, it should work if everything goes correctly. So, I just wanted to document this before I actually do the fix.